Alright guys, so I just went out a little bit and farmed, got some more. And then I found out that we have items in here that can require some more blood. We've got quite a lot of them, to be honest. I'll go from the small ones and work my way up. Use multiple. Let's do this again. Crank it, soldier boy. God, that, that's an old song. I say it a lot, just because, you know. Oh, why not? Uh, use multiple and I say no. Ooh, we're hitting 20k now. And by the weapon. Ooh, 1k each. I want to see what these ones are worth. One and a half each. This will crank us way over, hopefully. Oh, look at that. I think we've just got enough to use the weapon. So we're going to have to buy it. Welcome. Hello, my love. Very well. Let me. Oh, and we have enough to go up one level. It's just enough. What's the next one? Eight two. All right. Farewell. I'm gonna replace. Ah, oh, I don't want to replace the axe yet. So. D and E. D and D. And D. Let's have a look at this bad boy. Oh. It's a little bit slow with that attack. Oh, it's a um it's a it's a thrust. Thrust to cool. Now let's see what the big attack is. Oh. oh, it's a thrusting attack. Nice. Now let's go soldier boy this up. Fortify this weapon. I want to try this rifle spear out too. Thank God. We had enough to crank it. We aren't going to do the rifle spear at the moment. Just because we can't. Blood gems. Alright. I don't know how to remove them. So what I'll do is I'll just take... Make them shitty ones. Okay, what do we got here? Blind attack up. Add physical. Jesus, look at that. Okay, see how it's got thrust damage, blunt damage? It's got a bit of everything. What's the other weapon come up as then? This one's got thrust as well. This doesn't have thrust. It's got like an all-rounder going around here. So which one's the blunt attack? Must be the big one. Uh, or the normal. Alright, so... That seems one of the best gems. And this one... What have I got in here? Just for shits and giggles, I'll leave it open so I got all of them. Mm, do I want it? 37, 48, 37, 34. Yeah, I'll crank this one in it. Just because I want to give this good weapon a good crack. Alright, we got. 26 27 all right so 130 plus 37 109 plus 27 125 plus 23 so this weapon does have a lot of potential 135 plus 33 this one this one here has got a lot of damage too all right let us see how we handle it but Cathedral Ward. Let's go. See you there. Alright.
Alright, how sick does it does this look? I swear where was the other This gem here? Must go in a different socket, that's why. Shape oh a warning shape. See the shape of the last one? See there's a triangle? Should've checked the Kerr camera. What was that? Alright, let's go. This guy's hiding everywhere here. Not really hiding everywhere. Alright, bitch. You upset me by hitting me once. Kind of that shit. Look bad in front of everyone else. Attacks to, strain, attacks to stamina is another thing you gotta look at. How many attacks you can get out with the amount of stamina that you're cranking. Oh shit, sorry. Because there's a lot of guys that are weak to thrust attacks. So it's good to have this. Oh shit. Take a while to get used to, because I had a good attack with this weapon. Have to look around. Alright, so that's where we came from before. So we went and had a quick look. There's a ladder here. I like ladders. Ladders lead to zones. Zones are fun. It's easy. To have fun. What do we got? Numbing mist. Consumable. Throw to create a mist cloud that prevents HP restoration. Alright. Said to be used by the blood hunters of Kanehurst. Its recipe is a secret closely guarded by the line of nobles inhabiting the castle. Oh, that's cool. Um, obviously, there's probably mobs later on. Dudes that you fight that recover HP fast. So, they're probably the guys you want to use it on. Or probably PvP. Oh, well. There's a item on the other side of this house over there that we saw before. So I'm guessing there must be a hidden one lurking around here somewhere. Oh, oh, oh. Black messenger hat. Black messenger hat. A hat the messenger oddly fond of. Symbol of preventative hunters of the healing church. The inhabitants of the stump appear to have an interest in adornment. Why not let them be happy and reveal as baby? Alright, so we're back here. We just came up. Let us go. Let us know. Let us know. Let us know. Everybody's gonna know. Alright, so where are we now? Here we go. Oh shit. Fast. Oh shit, I was getting cocky then. See, there's a, there's a tiny little bit um, of invulnerability there. We become invulnerable. Works a bit faster. Fuck. But I wanted to crank this into. How? Eat it, bitch. Now let's go kill this bitch. see shit see, he gets screwed when he 
does that big attack, you don't know how long it's going to take to actually attack. But that actually had the longest punishing time. Uh, when, when I say punishing time, it's like... When you go do a big attack, you open for that, for that bit of time. So if I do this, there's a time where I can't actually move. Roll out of the way, do anything. I want to get that item there. Eat it. Oh, oh, we got another shortcut. Is this another shortcut or have we not been here? Oh, hang on. Here we go. Let's climb this one. Sounds a little bit easier. Not a secretive. Oh, it's only 10 bullets as well. That sucks. There's a big guy in there. I don't know where that gate leads to. Can't get in there. But yeah, punishing attacks is when you... You open... When someone can punish you, you leave it open too long to be punished. Your vulnerability. So I do that. I can't do anything for a split, like, two seconds afterwards. So I get punished. When he did that big swing, it's going to probably kill me in one go. But he's stuck, and there was a long punishing time in there. All right, should I go in there? No, I'm going to go this way. I like, I like switching around some of these areas. They're pretty cool. But I've been told this weapon's buff, so I've got to work out the combos for it. Oh, me. Holy crap. One more. That guy's down. Eat my bitch. This weapon's a bit harder to get used to. I don't like it as much, to be honest, than the other one. What's that symbol? Let's have a look. Frenzy. Okay. What's that do to you? Cracked walls. No items. I just want to know why this weapon's so good. Maybe I gotta test out some combos with it. For now, safety. Bloodshot eyeball. I don't mind if I do. Oh, hang on. It's another material used in Holy Chalice rituals. An exquisite eyeball removed quickly after death, or perhaps even before, used to unlock the seal to the old labyrinth hinted terms. Fair enough. I don't know where we're venturing, but it looks like it's going to be fun. Oh, mad. We got some more hunter's marks. It's getting low on those. I don't want to buy any more. Okay, let's crank this weapon. Still want to crank it. It's a long path, man. Long path. Where are we now? Should crank it, saying it. I guess they're cranking a lot, aren't they? Oh, this guy's dead. Stand up here. Holy shit, holes. I'm gonna run for a bit now. Wanna get, wanna work out how these dogs attack. Okay, they're actually quite weak. That's one good thing. Oh man, couldn't they be twin blood stone shards? Damn, really want to upgrade my weapon. I don't need this, but I'm going to take it anyway. Cause what else am I going to do? Leave it there. Now where's this dog? Oh man, I thought that actually moved for a second. Woo! Oh, there he is. Sneaky, sneaky. Oh. Jeez, 
Jesus. Yeah, we just gotta not gonna loot these guys anymore. Oh, man. Oh, this one's not a gun guy. Silver bullets, but I'm gonna loot them anyway. Because I gotta make sure that's the silver bullet from before. There was an item. Oh, here it is. The pebbles. And again, another item that I'm full on. Holy crap! 